Faith Chapinjetic Kipiagon, born January 10, 1994, is a Kenyan middle and long distance runner. Kipiagon is the current world record holder for the 1,500 meters and mile, both set in 2023, and the former world record holder for the 5,000 meters. Kipiagon won a gold medal each at the 2016 Rio de Janeiro Olympics and the 2020 Tokyo Olympics in the 1,500m. She also won a gold medal in the 1,500m at the 2017, 2022 and 2023 World Athletics Championships and in the 5,000m at the 2023 World Athletics Championships. As a junior, Kipiagon won gold medals at the 2011 and 2013 World Cross Country Championships and in the 1500M at the 2011 World Youth Championships and the 2012 World Junior Championships. Kipiagon was cited as one of the top 100 most influential Africans by New African Magazine in 2017. Early life and background Faith Kipiagon was the eighth of nine children growing up on a farm in a village near Karanjet, Nakuru County in the Kenyan Rift Valley. She comes from a Kalenjin tribe. Her elder sister and former training partner Beatrice Mute is a 10 kilometers and half marathon specialist. Her father Samuel Kipiagon Coach was a 400M and 800M runner in his youth, while her mother Lina Coach had also contact with athletics. Faith was a soccer player until she was introduced to athletics at school aged 14. She lined up for a 1km run in PE class and won that race by 20 meters. She attended Winners Girls High School in Karanjet. Personal life and coach Kipiagon is married to middle-distance runner Timothy Kaidem, the 2012 Olympic 800M bronze medalist. They have a daughter, Alan, born in June 2018. She trains in Kaptagat and Kapsabet, coached since the end of 2017 by Patrick Sang, Triple Global 3000 M Steeplechase Silver Medalist, who is also coaching marathon world record holder Eliud Kipchoge. Junior career in 2010, at age 16, a barefooted Kipiagon made her international debut at the World Cross Country Championships held in Bydgosz, Poland, competing against athletes up to three years her senior. She placed fourth in the women's junior race as the youngest finisher in the top 21 and earned the gold medal with her under-20 team, it was a Kenyan 1-4 sweep. Later that year, she showed her track potential by finishing third in the 1500 meters at the Kenyan World Junior Championship Trials in Nairobi. Kipiagon at the 2012 World Junior Championships in Barcelona. Running barefoot again, Kipiagon went three better and won the individual gold medal at the 2011 edition in Punta Umbria, Spain, adding a silver with her team. A few months later, she raced the 1500M at the World Youth Championships in Villeneuve d'Ascq, France, taking the women's crown ahead of two Ethiopian runners with a time of 4 minutes and 9.48 seconds and breaking the championship record in the process. Her 2012 season started with a bang as, after the 800m race in April, she set a swift national junior 1500m record of 4 minutes and 3.82 seconds at the Shanghai Diamond League meeting, 5th, the following month. In June, the 18-year-old won the event at the Kenyan Junior Athletics Championships, and finished 3rd at the Kenyan Olympic Trials to secure a spot on the national team for the 2012 Olympic Games in London. At the World Junior Championships held in July in Barcelona, she ran a championship record again to claim gold in her specialist event way ahead of the field with a time of 4 minutes and 4.96 seconds. Serbian Amla Terzic and Ethiopian Sender Tefri took second and third place respectively. She placed ninth in her heat at the London Olympics in August in a time of 4 minutes and 8.78 seconds, sixth after later doping disqualifications, failing to advance to the semifinals. At the beginning of the 2013 season, she defended her junior title at the World Cross Country Championships in Bidgosh, PL. On May 10 at the Diamond League meeting in Doha, Qatar, she broke for the first time the four-minute barrier in the 1500M, clocking an African U-20 and Kenyan senior record of 3 minutes and 56.98 seconds. Kipiagon finished second behind Swedish runner Abiba Aregui but beat Ethiopia's Genzi Dababa in third. In August, at the Moscow World Championships, the 19-year-old came fifth in the final in a time of 4.05.08, senior career 2014, 
Commonwealth champion in March, she claimed victory in the senior women's race, 8 kilometers, at the African Cross Country Championships held in Kampala, Uganda, beating silver medalist by more than 8 seconds. In May, she was a member of the team which won the gold medal in the 4x1500m relay at the first IAAF World Relays in Nassau, Bahamas, along with Mercy. Cheryl No, Irene Jelligat, and Helen O'Byrie. The Kenyan team, ahead of the United States and Australia, set a new world record of 16,33.58. That same year in July, Kipiagon took her first senior 1500M victory, becoming the Glasgow Commonwealth Games champion in Scotland with a time of 4,08.94. The 20-year-old finished fifth over the distance, however. At the African Championships staged in Marrakesh, Morocco in August, clocking a disappointing 4,13.46, Faith Kipiagon, L, collecting her first individual senior global medal, a silver. For the 1500M at the 2015 World Championships in Beijing. 2015, World Championship silver medalist on August 25, Kipiagon won a silver in the 1500M event at the World Championships held in Beijing. After a tactical race she finished second in a time of 4 minutes and 8.96 seconds behind only then-fresh world record holder Genzeeb Dababa who clocked 4 minutes and 8.09 seconds. Sifan Hassan representing the Netherlands was third in 4.09.34. On September 11, she secured her first Diamond League victory, winning the mile race in Brussels. It was the notable success as she set a meeting an African record of 4 minutes and 16.71 seconds, beating Hassan who ran 4 minutes and 18.20 seconds in the final stretch. 2016, first Olympic title in Rio Kipiagon got her Olympic campaign off to a strong start on May 14, racing the 1500M at the Shanghai Diamond League. She improved her own 2013 Kenyan record to 3 minutes and 56.82 seconds for a win, setting also the meeting record. Two weeks later, she repeated all these feats at the Eugene Diamond Race meet in Oregon, USA, lowering her national record to 3 colon 56.41. She also notched up victory in the mile event during Oslo Diamond League in June. Kipiagon celebrates her first Olympic 1500M victory in 2016 in Rio de Janeiro. The then 22-year-old became the Olympic 1500M champion in Rio de Janeiro reversing the order from the previous year's world championships. She outsprinted Dababa in the final 200M in what was initially a very slow tactical race, with a third lap in 56.80 and last 800M in a fast 800M race's pace of 1,57.2. Kipiagon clocked 4 minutes and 8.92 seconds, Dababa 4 minutes and 10.27 seconds, and Jenny Simpson was third in 4 minutes and 10.53 seconds. 2017, first senior world title she earned her first Diamond League 1500M trophy, winning three races in Shanghai, USA's Eugene and Brussels. It was the first season of the series to feature the new championship-style system in which overall event winners are determined only by the results of the final meet. Kipiagon outsprinted her rival Sifan Hassan at the Brussels final in September, 3 minutes and 57.04 seconds to 3 colon 57.22. At the 2017 World Championships in London, Kipiagon, Ellen Red, won her first senior world title, beating, 2-5, Jenny Simpson, DSD athlete Castor Semenya, Laura Muir and Sifan Hassan. Her best success of that year was the first place at the London World Championships in August, becoming the first Kenyan female World 1500M champion and only the third woman in history to win both the Olympic and World Championships finals over the distance. The 23-year-old ran 4 minutes and 2.59 seconds while a further three women also recorded times below 4.03, with Jenny Simpson in second and DSD athlete Castor Semenya third. I won the Olympics in 2016 but the victory at the World Championships in 2017 was sweeter because I fought the hardest. In 2016 Rio, I was only wary of Genzeeb Dababa of Ethiopia because I had a fantastic season. In London, Castor Semenya, Dababa, Sifan Hassan, Laura Muir and Jennifer Simpson were all gold medal prospects, Kipiagon said, at this point she decided to start a family, 2018-2020, motherhood and comeback, world championship silver medalist Kipiagon followed her doctor's advice and trained until she was between 4 and 5 months pregnant.
She gave birth to her first child, a daughter Alan, in June 2018 by a cesarean section due to the wrong position of her baby. Kipiagon returned to training in January 2019 after an almost 18-month break. At the end of June six months later, 12 months after the childbirth, she made her racing comeback in style, winning her specialty in 3 hours 59 minutes and 4 seconds at the Eugene Diamond League, the Prefontaine Classic, held that year in Palo Alto. In the 1500M final at the 2019 Doha World Championships, Faith, Ellen Red, lost only to Siphon Hassan, returning after giving birth in the previous year. Kipiagon went on to take the silver medal at the World Championships in Doha, where she chopped more than two seconds from her 2016 Kenyan record in the final with a time of 3 minutes and 54.22 seconds. Sifan Hassan came first in 3 minutes and 51.95 seconds while third place Gudaf Sege set a personal best of 3 minutes and 54.38 seconds. In 2020, she competed at the Diamond League and Continental Tour meetings staying unbeaten in all her six races. In August, she ran the second fastest time ever, an African and Diamond League record in the 1,000 meters at the Hercules meet in Monaco, with her result of 2 minutes and 29.15 seconds just 0.17s short of the world record set back in 1996 by Svetlana Mastrakova. 2021, second back-to-back -back Olympic title in Tokyo in 2021, Kipiagon greatly improved her 2019 Kenyan national record at the Diamond League meetings. On June 10, she ran 3 minutes and 53.91 seconds at the Rome Golden Gala, staged exceptionally in Florence, to finish second just behind Sifan Hassan who timed 3 minutes and 53.63 seconds. On July 9 at the Monaco Hercules, Kipiagon chopped nearly 3 seconds from that mark for a win, stopping the clock at a world-leading 3 minutes and 51.07 seconds, the fourth-fastest female performance in history at the time and just one second off Genzeeb Dababa's world record, which was also set in Monaco in 2015. She outsprinted Hassan in the home straight by about 2.5 s. In the women's 1500m final of the delayed 2020 Tokyo Olympics in August, Kipiagon overtook Hassan in the last 200m to secure her second consecutive Olympic gold medal in the event in a time of 3 minutes and 53.11 seconds, breaking the game's record which had stood for 33 years. She became the second woman in history to win back-to-back -back Olympic 1500m titles. While Hassan faded in the home stretch, 3 minutes and 55.86 seconds for third, Laura Muir set a British record of 3 minutes and 54.50 seconds to clinch the silver medal. In September, she beat Hassan again at the Zurich Welt Class Diamond League final to take her second 1500M Diamond Trophy. Kipiagon won 9 out of her 10 races of the season. 2022, second senior world title in May. Kipiagon claimed victory in her signature event at the Eugene Diamond League in USA. Kipiagon with her record fourth global 1,500M gold medal at the 2022 World Championships in Eugene. At the World Championships held also in Eugene in July, Kipiagon decisively won the 1500M gold medal with a time of 3 minutes and 52.96 seconds, which made her the first female athlete to win four global titles over the distance. Gudaf Sege placed second in 3 minutes and 54.52 seconds while Laura Muir earned bronze, 3 minutes and 55.28 seconds. Dot. On August 10 at the Monaco Diamond League, Kipiagon came within 0.3s of Dababa's world record with 3 minutes and 50.37 seconds to set her new Kenyan record and the second fastest performance in history at the time. She split 60.5-62.1-62.1-45.67, last 400M in 61.3S, and as of August 2022 held 6 of the 13 fastest women's 1,500M marks in history. She ended her yet another successful season with a clear victory at the Zurich Circuit's final the following month, this time closing strongly after a tactical race, last lap in 57.8, to earn her third Diamond League 1500M title. Kipiagon won all her six 1,500M races of the season. In November interview with Athletics Weekly, she said that in the future she would like to run marathons. 2023 Present
World 1500M and 5000M Records Kipiagon got her 2023 campaign off to strong start on February 4 with a dominant victory at the Syracuse Cross Country Classic, 10 km, on home soil in Alderat. On June 2, she eventually got the only thing that was missing on her resume. Setting a World 1500M record of 3 minutes and 49.11 seconds to become the first woman in history to break the 3 50 barrier in the discipline. The 29 year old sliced almost a second from Dababa's mark, 3 minutes and 50.07 seconds, while running a big negative split at the Rome Diamond League stage that year, also in Florence. She hit 802 minutes and 4.1 second, as a pacemaker was asked for, WR pace was 2 minutes and 2.7 seconds, and passed the bell in 2 minutes and 50.2 seconds, Dababa hit the bell at 2 minutes and 50.3 seconds. Kipiagon was sensational over the final two laps, running her last 802 minutes and 0.6 seconds, last 458.81, and last 229.2. The entire race field congratulated and embraced her after her lap of honor. Kipiagon made it two world records in a week after breaking exactly seven days later, on June 9, let us bet GD's 5,000 meters world standard of 14 minutes and 6.62 seconds set in 2020. Faith's second world record came as a surprise as it was her first race over the distance since 2015 and the third ever. Racing in a thrilling duel with Lettuce and Bet at the Paris Diamond League, she smashed her old PB, 14 minutes and 31.95 seconds, and sliced 1.42 s off that world record with a time of 14 minutes and 5.20 seconds. She overtook her with 600m to go but Lettuce and Bet was closely following, with both lagging about 6 seconds behind the world record pace. Kipiagon ran a last lap in 60.6 s and dropped Lettuce and Bet in a sprint finish in the last 200 m timed at 28.1 s, even faster than in her 1500 m world record race. She became only the second woman in history to hold both the 1500 m and 5000 m records simultaneously after Paula Pigney in 1969, and the first Kenyan woman to hold the latter. Circuit wins and titles Diamond League 1500 meters champion. 3 2017, 2021, 2022, 1,500 meters wins, other events specified in parentheses 2015, 1 Brussels Memorial Van Dam, 1 Mile, WLAR, 2016, 3 Shanghai Diamond League, WL Mr. NR, Eugene Prefontaine Classic, WL Mr. NR, Oslo Bislet Games, 1 Mile, WL, 2017, 3 Shanghai, W.L., Eugene, Brussels, S.B., 2019, 1 Prefontaine Classic in Palo Alto, S.B., 2020, 3 Monaco Hercules, 1000M, D.L.R.A.R., Brussels, 1000M, Doha Diamond League, 800M, W.L.P.B., 2021, for Doha, 800M, Monaco, W.L.N.R., Eugene, M.R., Zurich Well Class 2022, 3 Eugene, WLMR, Monaco, WLNR, Zurich 2023, 3 Doha, WL, Rome Golden Gala in Florence, WR, Paris Meeting, 5000M, WR, World Athletics Cross Country Tour 2022 23, Syracuse Cross Country Classic National Titles Kenyan Cross Country Championships Senior Women's Race, 2014, 2015 Awards and Honors Kenyan Sports Personality of the Year, Sportswoman of the Year, 2021, 2022, World Athletics, World Athlete of the Year, 2023 Laureus World Sports Award for Sportswoman of the Year, 2024 nominee.